It's time to just touch on two rounds in, who's hot and who's not. Well, Mallow was hot again. He didn't get over that 33. I don't think he's going to get over that. But, gee, yeah, I had a good crack at it. Averaging 28 points a game for Cairns. So he was good. Sobe has been unbelievable this year. Making that transition to a point guard, 20 points a game. He's uh, shooting 51%. And he's got 23 assists to only six turnovers. Probably the best stat out of his stat line for the season. And Todd Blanchfield. 20 points a game, shooting the three ball at 50%. And if there's anything the Hawks need, it's that three ball. And he's been able to stand up. Hasn't been consistent because he, he had two great games wedged with that bad one over in Perth. But they're going to need him to continue to do that for the rest of the year. Yeah, hot Why am I wearing this, up. mate? I'm done with You're this. Just, Why am I... Shane Frolling's going to be yeah, I'm gonna get <laughs> double punches. You're going to remind me of that. That's actually looking really sharp. I just enjoyed the show. So that's who's hot, and you're not very hot for leaving that on, but who else is, is not hot? Well, not hot is Devin Hall. Five points a game. He is three from 18 from the field. He is ice cold, and two from 13 from threes. So when you lose a game at home like that, in a game that you're expected to win if you're going to really push for the playoffs, and it's your first you know, go at this club as an import, that's not good. Casper Ware, if we were seeing Casper Ware for the first time, we'd be doubting that he's a very good player. And we know he's a great player. He's one of the league's best players because he's proven he's won championships and he's been amazing over the years. But he's shooting 23%, 17% from threes, and he's got 14 assists to 11 turnovers. So you would expect over time he's going to be able to turn that around because he's all class. Still top five in assists and steals, but definitely not shooting at the high level we expect of him. But still 14 assists to 11 turnovers is not good enough. We just spoke about Sobi, 23 assists to six turnovers. So his floor game is not good enough either. Don't worry about just that. He's not playing his game that he needs to be able to play. There's nothing surer when you say someone's not hot, they're coming out of a big game this week. So watch for Casper Ware to get it done as United travel over to Perth and get the win there, which would be great to see. I'll get another poke, two from two. And uh, also, who else did you call out? Uh, Devon Hall, who I think, uh, I saw him in the Blitz and I thought he was great. So young guy, freshly drafted. Watch for those two this week. Well, I'm, not, not I'm not sure we're calling him out. I think what we're stating is what they've done so far. Yeah. So everyone's got the opportunity to be able to go and do their job and be able to improve their stats and do what they do. So we hope they do. We look forward to watching it this week. That's all we've got time for this week on The Basketball Show. 